Good morning, Northeast Kansas. Welcome to Tuesday, April 26th. I'm Dave with the Lawrence Juice, bringing you today's highlights from our to-do list. You can stop by the Lawrence Public Library to see an exhibit of artwork by Catherine Mayhouse through April 30th. The Harvester's Food Pantry will be open at Catholic Charities, located at 1525 West 6th Street in Suites A and B. Stop by between the hours of 9 a.m. and 3.30 p.m. There is an N.A. Literature Study meeting, which starts at noon at the Plymouth Congregational Church on Vermont Street. This meeting takes place every Monday. Be sure to bring a bag lunch with you. There will be a guided tour of the Monarch Watch Garden on KU's West Campus beginning at 3.30 this afternoon. Learn about the program in general, which plants attract monarch butterflies, and how to participate in the Tagging and Tracking program. The Dole Institute of Politics will present the Future of Big Tech, a courtroom-style program in which two advocates will argue either side of this important national issue. It begins at 6 p.m., both in person and online. Luna Luna will perform at the Bottleneck tonight at 7 p.m. with guest Dream Girl. This is an all-ages show, and tickets are available online and at the door. At 7 o'clock this evening, the KU Wind Ensemble and Crossroads Wind Symphony will perform at Lead Center of Kansas. Tomorrow morning, don't forget about One Million Cups Lawrence. This program offers local startups an opportunity to present their companies to a diverse audience of mentors, advisors, and entrepreneurs. This week, the Kansas Board of Regents will join us. Come help us reach our goal of One Million Cups. The complete to-do list is in the Lawrence Juice, which comes out every other week on Wednesdays. You can find your copy at River Rat Print and Skate on North 2nd Street, Cotton's Hardware and Rental at 1832 Mass Street, and many other places around town. You can even go to lawrencejuice.com to find the online version of our magazine and our live to-do list calendar. Have a great day, and come back tomorrow for another installment of the To-Do List, hosted by the Lawrence Juice.